Hello all, today in this video I am going to provide details regarding the implementation of an convolution neural network in Python which is uh, CNN. In the previous video itself I have shown the uh, layers which we have used in the convolution neural network. In the previous video if you have watched means you can just see the code and the explanation which I have given. So in this code we can just check uh, the uh, values of the performance matrix and the difference between the uh, in the previous code I have given that uh, in the previous code I used an activation function ReLU for multi-class classification but in this code we can just uh, first we can check with ReLU and the next time we can just check with softmax classification uh, layer since we are using uh, um, multi-class classification and just we can see the difference between the performance and moreover in the uh, previous uh, uh, code if you see means we I haven't provided code for confusion matrix and also the uh, graph for accuracy and loss and moreover the values regarding precision recall and F1 score so in this code we have added that too so this is the code which we saw previously in the previous video and now we can just check the values for the loss and accuracy graph you can see loss it is initially it was high and now it is decreasing uh, so for a better system you may know the loss should decrease and the accuracy should increase so here you can see the loss is decreasing and accuracy is increasing for every iteration you can just notice a decrease in loss and an increase in accuracy and then we are moving to the values of the Confusion matrix that is the performance matrix variables which is precision recall F1 score. So it is 17 uh, though we got nearly here 70% but in accuracy we got only 17%. So in the next video we can just check some steps to how to increase this accuracy. In the previous video itself I would have said to uh, said that to increase the accuracy of a deep learning model we have to increase the number of uh, uh, images since we are now using only 80 images so in the next week video we can just check with uh, some different number of images if there is some scarcity of images we can just move with data augmentation the data augmentation we can just see in our uh, later videos so then uh, we i have also used uh, the confusion matrix definition to plot the confusion matrix of the four uh, classes which we have used such as the cats, dogs, horses and humans. Uh, so you can just see the confusion matrix uh, uh, graph. So this is the graph we achieved for confusion matrix and this is the very uh, va value we got with the ReLU activation function. So now we can just work with the uh, softmax. So all, uh, softmax activation function. So already I have just uh, fixed it as softmax that is uh, in this layer, dense layer, final layer. So it is run and then we can just compile the model. So now the approaches are running. So in every approaches we can see there is an increase in validation accuracy. But uh, if you see in this uh, thing which is uh, our model which is uh, while we are performing the performance metrics, you can see that it's not increasing. That is, uh, uh, it is only 0.17. So for that, we have to now it has uh, increased to 20, but that's 20 is not a very much good accuracy so we can just uh, check in our next video what is the steps to increase this and we can also just uh, run the confusion matrix so this is the difference between the relu activation function and the softmax activation function uh, um, i will just work with uh, so again with the relu too i think in, uh, it will just provide some less accuracy when compared to the softmax since we are having only less number of images, the time to uh, train is uh, very less. If you are using high number of images, means the time will also increase. So with the ReLU, you can see the at loss is not is a, a constant, and also the accuracy is also constant. So previously we got twenty. 
here but uh, in accuracy we are getting 23% so we can just move to the confusion matrix so obviously there is some difference between the softmax and the ReLU activation function uh, so this is the code for CNN in the next video we can see some other uh, basic code in Python thank you